Hi guys! Welcome back to another video. Following on from the video on Thursday, I thought I'd do a little haul of what we got from Bursal. So stick around to see what we got. <laughs> So you're going to notice from what we're showing you that we've got a lot of glass stuff, mainly storage containers, because I'm obsessed. Has anyone been watching those videos on TikTok where they're like stocking up the fridge or like putting pasta into jars? So... Oh, we're going to strike in, strike, <laughs> straight into it. We've got some jars. It looks dirty, but it isn't. It's just one of the items that's rubbed off on it, which you'll see later. <laughs> so we got two of them and these were £2.50 each, which I think is a bargain for a big glass container like this. And we haven't set in stone what we're going to put in them yet, but Jacob suggested pasta and rice, so we might give that a go. I swear you did. No, you did. Moving on to another glass item, we got two. What would you even call these? Glass bottles with corks in. Glass bottles with corks in. <laughs> we thought with this we could fill it up with like juice or milk or something and keep it in the fridge. And these were also £2.50 each, which again, bargain. The next item we only got one of, and I had to convince Jacob to let me get it. A little storage jar. You could put tea bags in it. Mmm. Well, it's like a tea baggy tea bag pot. <gasps> I think that'd be cute. We didn't know what we were gonna put in it, but I said it was small, so I wanted it. I think this was one pound <coughs> fifty. I'll leave the links to all the items that we got in the description box below if anyone wants to check them out or if we've got the prices wrong. We also got some shot glasses. Oh, I've got one. We have four, but we've only got three here. We're already using one. <laughs> we got four shot glasses and we also got a glass mug because I've been having peppermint tea recently and I've got a glass mug, but I got it for Jacob, so I wanted my own. And that's fancy with some ribbon on it. There you go. I've been trying to find the funky names that like your name everything, but yeah. I don't have any. Another glass storage item that we got is a glass jug. Because I had a vision when I've got like the family round or like friends round in summer and we've got the barbecue going, I can make like sangria in it. Pins. Pins. Like something like that. And like it'll be nice. I hope it'll be nice. So moving on. To the last storage container by the way i look really bad when i'm filming this my hair's like in a mess and my face is a different color to my skin because i fake tanned because we're going out tonight Whoop. okay this one has a name yeah rag tan <laughs> no rag tan read. we got some herbs and spices containers these were how much were they like 175 one each not like I each container like but for four so we got three packs oh did we oh yeah we like our herbs and spices so yeah. we kind of worked out before we bought them how many we'd need and if we have any left over we'll just have to get more herbs and spices so this is what they're like they're just like small little jars they've got like a a flat side so you could yeah you could stand them like that that's cute so sticking to the kitchen theme we also got some little tongs these look really cute they have like a little thing here which you can use to close them but we got these because we're just sick Jeez. we're just sick of not having tongs to like turn over our steak Turn over our bacon. Stuff like that, you know what I mean? Spaghetti. Spaghetti. Which I wasn't allowed to use because I had to save it for the video. <laughs> that was fun. So we got some little tongs. And we opted for the smaller ones. They did have like a big pair of tongs. 
but we decided to go for the smaller ones just because I just thought they were like cute and you can like with both hands. I wanted some crocodile clips because we haven't got any and they're useful. I didn't really want multicoloured, they're a bit. Yeah, I don't really go with the theme of our yeah. kitchen. Like a grey and black. Yeah, would have gone nice. Yeah, or cream. But you get 20 little ones and 10 big ones and they're just That's super good. useful. How much were they? Like a quid, 150. That is worth. £1.50. So when we went round we got to like the restaurant bit and they had like some food. So we decided to get a couple things. Can I get these? There's yours. Kafarep, which are basically looks like jammy dodges. Dodges. <laughs> jammy dodges. Oh no, German. <laughs> German Why is it not in Swedish? Raspberry flavoured biscuits. And this is the culprit that's rubbed off on everything and we decided to get them because next weekend we've got jacob's family coming up to see the house for the first time the very first time in person and we're going to be doing like a little spread for them we thought these on a little plate might be cute so we'll hope you like it and the thing that i picked up in the restaurant bit is savory sauce mix because I've previously been to Ikea a very long time ago and I had meatballs, chips and what I thought was gravy, but it looked like this. So I'm hoping if we make it up, it is this because it was delicious. Looks great. No, because if it's delicious. No, because it was like that colour. Three minutes. It looks disgusting. Yeah, it did look pretty bad to be fair. What's it taste like? Gravy. Really nice gravy. I'm excited. I hope it is the gravy. Alamann Stratton. I said that well. In it. We got two of them and I think they were, how much, like 75p each yeah. or 80p. So I'm looking forward to trying that and I'll let you know how it goes if it actually is the gravy. And if it is, you're going to be annoyed you only got two. Yeah. We'll just have to go back. On this one, what you're holding, yeah. do you not think it looks a bit like Shrek? Yeah. <laughs> I'm sick of doing baking videos and saying, I don't have a sieve yet, so I'm just gonna put the flour right in. So I got a sieve. So moving on to the rest of our stuff, we've only got a few more items left, but we got to like the little plant section and they had a lot of fake plants, which I'm not a fan of because they do look really fake. So I wanted to go to the real plant section. So they had plant pots, so I got foreign leg foreign leg and it's just like a plastic plant pot i have a few plants over there you saw them in my bonsai tree video i'll leave a link if you want to check that out but i've got a few house plants and they're getting bigger now so i've got a bigger plant pot for one of them we also got another plant pot because we bought a plant so we needed a plant pot for it it's just a pot one and it is a bit big for the plant that we got, but I think it looks okay. So that's what we got. This is muscot, if anyone wants to look it up. I can't remember how much it was, maybe three pound. There wasn't a very good range of white plant pots that fit it yeah. somehow. You think that'd be the easiest thing to find? So we have a little round circle in the bottom just to prop, it, prop the plant up. <laughs> for the pot plant pot, we got an aloe vera plant. I had one when I was younger and I can't remember if I actually used it but I feel like we will use this because I like the feel of aloe vera. But it fits in like this and it doesn't look too bad in my opinion. No. It's a bit wobbly but I don't think it looks too bad and we thought this is kind of like a bathroom plant, so we'll put it in the bathroom. But now that I think about it, maybe the bathroom's a bit dark because of the frosted glass. We'll see. Mm -hmm. It'll either go in the bathroom or the kitchen, but all our plants are in the kitchen at the moment. So that's that plant. And the other plant we got was... <laughs> oh my God. A lucky bamboo. 
<laughs> it came in like this little thing here. It's got some water in it just to keep it moist. But we did get a little glass vase or vase. How do you say it? Vase. Vase. That's vase glass. is American. A vase. We did get a little glass vase um, to put it in and we looked it up beforehand and you grow it in water and to keep it sturdy because you can see that it's like slant if you just put it in like that. To keep it upright, we also got some... Diffed. <laughs> Diffed. Some rocks. Literally just some pebbles. So we'll put a few of them in the bottom to keep it upright and then top it up with water and hopefully we will grow our lucky bamboo and we'll be lucky as long as it's alive, which I don't think will be very long. So there's only one more thing that we got from Ikea and then there's one thing that we got from HomeSense. But the thing from Ikea is just um, a pack of tea lights. So these are red berry. Cindy. Red berry. They smell good, I think. Yeah. I don't know why there's two different... I don't know if one's raspberry and one's... Yeah, there's like different colour. But they smell very nice and I think they'll be nice to just like dot around the house. And hopefully it just makes it smell nice. But that's everything from Ikea. There's only one more thing to show you. Well, obviously we've got the big Ikea bags. They're a must. And yeah. hot dogs, but we can't show you them. And ho oh yeah, you saw them in the last video, the hot dogs. Oh, and we've got some chocolate donuts. They were delicious. The thing that we got from HomeSense is just another sand and fog candle. This is in tropical citrus and it smells very nice. Jacob told me I wasn't allowed any more sand and fog candles because they're expensive and we have enough already. What's this, number four? Three? Three. Let me smell. So he said that I wasn't allowed any more because they are expensive and I've had a few, but Here it was are. on sale. <laughs> It was four pounds down from 7 99 So I was like, I have to get it. So I did. And it smells nice. They also had like lavender or something. It didn't smell very nice. No. So that's everything. If you enjoyed the video, guys, please leave a like and a comment down below. And if you're new, hi. We do a lot of different types of videos on our channel. We've just hit 100 subscribers. So if you want to... Mm. <laughs> if you want to be a part of the channel and stick around to watch all the videos we've got coming up we've got a few fun ideas please hit that subscribe button Lit. bye guys bye <laughs>